Hey everybody, Ak here is here. Welcome back to the Hunter Call of the Wild. Alright, so let's uh not really pick up where we left off because I uh no longer have the same character I did before with all the level end up and all that sort of stuff. One that was a the one last one we saw was during the promotion for uh for the uh the Mexico reserve. Uh what was that? Rancho de Arroyo. But uh since since I played that my little girls have started playing and they went ahead and created a new character which is fine because you can only have one character on the game at a time so they started off with level one and and basically the bare bones items so i'm just going to basically be playing their character a little bit and uh we're going to share it and if you suddenly like see me go from having you know fifty thousand m's in going in game uh currency to like zero and i i suddenly have one thousand uh uh, scent eliminators and it's just because they're playing the game so no big deal i think uh might go for Ooh, that might be fun yukon valley that might be fun too um i think i want to go for yeah let's do uh let's do siberia all right here we go i think this is where they were last playing too also so, let me see here where we at. We got some tracks over here already. Uh, we should have, yeah, I, I helped them get more ammo for their uh, 30 out 6. So they basically have the uh, 243 and the 30 out 6. Um, not many collars that I'm aware of. Let me see here. Let me see. Yeah, they've pressured this area. They're doing pretty good. They're 6 and 8 years old, and they've brought down uh, my youngest one, the 6-year-old. She brought down her first... Uh, her first shot completely by herself, her handling the mouse and the breathing and all that stuff. She brought down a moose. Ooh, that might be worth tra tracking. Let's head that way. She brought down a moose on her very first shot at about 250 meters with a heart shot. Straight on. So, and then she got another moose that returned to a water, the same watering hole. And then she also got a bear, all in about a 30 minute span. I think they were, I think those last two, the, the bear and that last moose were, were, uh, that looks like a moose. Yeah. Oh, that's a male moose. Okay. We'll go that way then. That's going to be more interesting to me. But, uh, yeah, they were both female. But that first one, nice bull moose. Yeah. Pretty proud of her. She did a good job. They really enjoy this game. A lot, and uh, we're both getting pretty good at it. All right, I made these green. I don't know if that's the best choice or not. I think I let me go ahead and glass this area over here. I just decided I'd, I'd uh, jump in here. Weather's starting to turn, getting much more fall-like here in Ohio. The uh, fields are getting harvested. Temperatures are starting to drop off in the evening. It's, it's nice to sit down and play a nice peaceful game like the hunter so all right well i lost that track can't, can't couldn't have gone too far unless it hit one of these rocks and uh bounced off somewhere okay this is gonna be right here this is a uh, radioactive poop here let's see how old this is very old okay well oh, i got nothing else to do so i'll go ahead and track it I can. So the last one was over there. Now this is over here. I will stumble across something else sooner or later. I don't think we have any lures or scents to use. Let me uh let me show you what we got as far as skills here. Uh not much. We have this one and this one. So location of tracks, a little more accurate, a little more narrow for the cone. The world on the map. And then uh, this one reveals animal gender, as we just saw with footprints or vocalizations. Our perks right here, we're working on rifle right now. Some muscle memory. So we can reload when we're keeping our crosshairs on target. And I think maybe next one we'll do uh, probably breath control because the girls need a little bit of extra time sometimes. And then... This will, these will both be really helpful for them. So, anyway, 
That's what we'll go for. What we got out there? Anything? I thought I saw something. Meh. Just tripping. Yeah, I must have just saw something render in or something like that. Might just want to follow the tracks and see where something crosses over here. Couldn't hurt. Let's see. Um, where do we want to go? Probably actually want to... I think I want to head down this way. See what that is. Where's that at? There it is. Okay, we got these tracks. Get out there. These are there's my moose again. All right, cool. You would run into it eventually. All right, I think we're gonna have a little better time tracking them now. Not the right color there. We need the green one. Or we're locked onto it. So yeah, now it's. Oh, let me check see what colors we got set up. Cause I know we changed the colors a little bit. Cause they're not white. That's a different one. Cause I, I think because of how much snow there is, you never have white by default here. So inactive is green, okay. Uh, chartreuse or whatever. It's Hollywood. Sur Surreys, Surreys, I guess, is uh, what we're currently tracking. So, all right. So we're looking for the pink now, okay. That's probably why I couldn't find more green tracks. All right, this seems a bit easier now. Yeah, he's trotting. I'm gonna go ahead and pick up the pace here a little bit. Since those are very old try to catch up with them a little bit. Okay, which way do we go? Pro this, eh, yeah, okay. A little hard with these rocks. There are a lot of rocks that they can deflect off of in this particular map. So, it seems like it could get a little pinball-y with their movements. So. There it is. Yep, sure enough. Change directions a little. I'm not going to try to uh, camp need zones like all other YouTubers do and just harvest the uh, the highest level ones looking for their big legendaries and mythicals and whatnot and their diamonds and stuff like that I'm not going to do that uh, I kind of wish they take uh, need zones out of the game honestly and just have them sort of roaming or at least have it so that need zones aren't almost a guarantee because as it stands now they're just so freaking predictable those need zones I wish it'd be like you know there's maybe a 10% chance they'll be there but otherwise, you're better off. And I like it that sometimes they just roam around. They're not always going from one... Oh, okay, we got something out here, I think. I think I see something. Maybe not. It's not moving. Nope. I thought that was a moose right there. Okay. But I, I wouldn't like... I, I, well, I like it so that they would maybe just roam around a little more. And they weren't always just going from one need zone to another. Because... There's basically two things that they're doing. They're either traveling from one need zone to another, or they're at the need zone. So they become a little predictable. I think in original, the original Hunter, it wasn't like that. Well, you know, they didn't have need zones, as far as I know, at least visible to the to the player. But yeah, I think it really sort of kills this, the game, honestly. Yeah, it's a musk here. Okay, I'm not really that interested in it. Maybe I'll call it in. I don't really have a real good area for, to call it into, but it's probably not, it's not gonna respond while it's in a startled state. So I'm gonna keep going for the moose. Let's just keep rocking the moose. Look at that. The god rays look beautiful. Getting thick. There we go. Well, I picked up my new motorcycle. So, 
I think uh, I'll do a video of me uh, getting it, and then I'll release my... That's yeah, the warning call from the moose. Okay. So let's go ahead and send eliminate here. Not how much of less we have left. They use it pretty judiciously. So, oh, we got ourselves a need zone here. I'm going to go ahead and pick that for the girls, because they, they will play need zones. That's fine. Part of them learning how to play the game. out here. I think it's going to be a moose one, actually. Yep, it is. It's a resting zone. So, he must be in the need zone here. He's probably going to be sitting up here resting, but I was tracking him, so I don't feel bad about shooting him. I had no idea that this existed. I was just following him, and hey, if he happens to stop at a need zone before I get to him, not my fault. Alright, this is a nice little open, open area, finally. Let's take a peek around here. See if we can see. I think his voice was out, like over this way a little. There it is. Okay. He's, there he is. I can see you. Let me hit you. Okay, there we go. Let's get out our number two gun, as we put it. Oh, there's two of them. Okay, hold on. Stand by. Let me see which one's better. Holy cow. That's a minor. That's number two. Uh, so the other one was better. Yeah. Did he just lie down? I think he just lied down. Or laid down. Yep, so did he. I think we got more out here. That, that other one sounded like it was over this direction. Oh, what a dangerous place to be right now. If it, if it was real life, oh my gosh. Do you even imagine? Our scent sucks. The direction sucks. Okay, that's the one I want, I think. I don't see a big one at this point in time. Seems a bit angry. Wait, is there one right in front of me? No, that's a rock. I thought I heard one over here. Maybe we'll startle one up. That's fine. Oh, he just ran. He just ran. He'll come back. He'll come back. Yeah, he'll come back. I think. What time what time is the Yeah, he'll come back, I think. I can see him I can see him moving back there. I think he's gonna reset and come back. I hear one close. That's me moving right there. He's trotting off. Maybe they're done. Maybe I caught him at the back end of it. That's alright. We know which way they went. I'll wait back here until they come back. Might creep up a little for, uh, closer. We can get a better, better vantage point. Might see one over here. That hasn't smelled me. I think those two smell me. If they reset, I should be in a better position for them. I want to, I want to see if there's a third one. I might be hanging with the group, but I swear I heard one call out from over here. Somewhere. up here and see if I can get up into a little better vantage point here. Take a look here. I heard one call out. Goodness gracious. That's a big splotch of blood right there. He's going to go down quick. Yeah. I just heard him behind me. That was it. Vital organ hit. All right, we'll give him a second here. Won't take him long to fall. Yeah, he won't take long. Oh, he did not spell me because my scent was going that way. 
and he, he approached from behind. Luckily, I was being quiet about the whole thing. So, all right, move up here. Should be able to just walk up now at this point. I'm sure he's down. Probably a medium bleed rate, right? I would hope that would be a double lung. At that range. Pretty sure I did not hit bone. I know I hit, obviously I hit lung, which is what I was going for. Nice of him to stop perfectly right there for me. It's very kind of him. We're going to eat well this uh, this winter. Moves chili for everybody. All right. somewhere. Couldn't have gone too far. I knew that's what I, I he looked bigger than the other one so I think he's going to be yeah there he is. I think he's going to be bigger than a three. Yeah maybe. I don't know maybe a four or five. I don't think he's that great. He doesn't look that big. But that was interesting. Yeah, I got silver out of it. Yeah, class eight. So he was level eight. Okay, and it was a double lung. I had a feeling it was going to be a double lung. But, uh, man. Uh, that's a pretty good double lung shot, honestly. And we kept the heart intact. So we can cook that up. Yep. Got ourselves a thousand dollars cash. Good deal. And that was a 20 meter shot. So, yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. Difficulty three. Yeah, not cla class eight is the uh, size of the animal, like uh, in accordance with your weaponry. I'm sorry, I misread that. I, I looked at the wrong one. Level three. So same as the one that we saw that ran off first. So there we go. We leveled up. Go ahead and uh, pick something here for the girls. Help them out a little bit here. So we got ourselves. Oh, it was a perk point this time. Okay. So I think we're going to do the. Uh, probably get rid of the wobble first. And then do breath control. Yeah, let's do that. Wonderful. All right, and off we go. All right, let's see if we can get another one here in the next 15 minutes or so. Let's try to keep these little hunts to about 30 minutes. Let's just see what we can grab when we go out. Um, I'm going to go ahead and see if I can get one of those uh, moose up here. So I'm going to run back to where we were. Start tracking them again. If we run into something better, I'll take that. Again, if you uh, want to know whether or not the animal actually died, you can always, unless you've already pressured the area, you can just check and see if it's been pressured. Because when they drop, it becomes pressured where you, where you shot them at. This, the center of uh, that pressured area is exactly where they got hit. So, not where they drop. It's not going to drop. Uh, it's not going to help. Okay, let's see if we can call this one in or, or at least stalk it. This one's been wanting to get shot for a while now, so let's see if we can do this. I think we have a, is it a roe deer collar that we use for this? I can't remember. It's been a while, so let's see here. Uh, bleat. Seek. Uh. Yeah. It's the bleak color. So, okay. Is that the right one? Yeah. I don't think he's going to respond. You don't have to do it twice. That's just what I do. And we're going to use the smaller rifle this time. First off, let me go ahead and reload this. Good practice to get into so you don't drop it on the empty chamber when you have that perfect shot. I'm gonna see. It looks like I might be able to see it if I can maybe crawl up this rock here a little bit. My scent isn't hateful, but if it's hanging out here, it seems like it's, yeah.
Let me do. Let me glass this area here. See if I can see any movement. Maybe I will. Let me zoom out a little bit there. See if we see any movement. He's down there somewhere. That little, that little sound is me turning. Right there. Right there. So, don't think he's walking up on me. Alright, well. Can I actually get up here? This would be kind of epic. This little perch would be great. I could, I could pro out. Call him in, get him nice. Do you want to come back and play? No, you're female. How far out are you? I'm just curious. I wonder if I can see you. You're out there somewhere. Yeah, I can't see you. Too much. Too much foliage. Foliage. Okay. All right, let me try calling him in again. Maybe he's reset and he's starting to calm down now. I'll spray myself down one more time. Don't do that. Don't clip. I wonder if you're inside the rock, if you fire, if it, the bullet will actually go out of the rock. Like that. I think we're okay here because we're actually sticking out. It's not my fault I clipped through the rock. Yeah, this is so much more fun than just running to an each need zone and playing playing the ambush game. You'd rather stalk. Wonder. Do a walkabout and stalk. You really want to get shot, aren't you? Alright. I don't remember seeing any females in that group. Maybe that's a second group that's sort of linked up together with each other. Just sort of moving around here. See if I can see different angles through these trees. Maybe I'll see something I couldn't see a second ago. It was occluded or something. There he is. There he is. Why you move around? So he's not gonna man, he's really close. Again. I wonder if I can I don't even know if I could actually hit him. I, th I think he might be behind a hill. That's going to be tough. Can I pull him out of there? I don't think he's going to budge. The wind's going the right direction. I, it looks like there is no wind, actually, but if it was moving, it would be moving the right direction. Let's see if we can get him to stand up. Maybe he's got friends. That's always possible, too, because if there's one, there, there's usually more for safety numbers and all that, right? No, you're just going to hang out there. You're going to stand up and move, though? There's got to be another one down there somewhere. So I think my level for hearing things is a little bit low. So that's why it, it projected it from over here, even though he was, like, right here, I think. Unless it was different Sika. Could be. But I think because uh, we've been reset to a lower level here, that's probably why. I need him to stand up. He'll stand up eventually. So it's just a it's just a waiting game. I don't want to approach because there's no really good way to approach him at this point. I have to go all the way back here. And by the time I did that, now I'd be facing, I'd be coming in from his back, which is never a good shot. I'd, or I'd have to go all the way around. And by the time I did that, he'd probably stand up. So I think the best bet is just to hold what we got here and keep an eye out for maybe some other ones that might be willing to... Uh, Die for the uh, good of the herd. All right. I, I think I can kind of see his ear. Yeah, I can see his ear there. I could take a sh head shot, but that would sort of ruin everything. If I took a body shot, I don't know if I'm going to hit him. I think I will, but it's not a clear shot by any means. I'm going to have to. I'm going to have to 
go through some some grass here, which isn't a big deal as long as it's not solid. I think we can do it. All right, let's give it a shot. Let's see what happens, quite literally. Let's give it a shot. He looks like he's running pretty good. I, I don't think it connected. Uh, maybe it did. All right, well, no point in being coy now. Did I get any bullet down here? Let's see. Or was this a complete waste? Yeah, that sucked. Yep. That sucked. He was right here. So he was down. Man, I must have dug in like I must my bullet must have hit impacted like right in here. Okay, well we know which direction he went, so we're gonna head that way. And now my scent is really working out well, so that's moose tracks. And we're looking for, there we go, pink, that should be fresh. He'll, he'll reset about 200 meters away, I'd imagine. And he'll probably start coming back, trying to make it back to this area. Might take a different path, but uh, we'll see. Oh, there he is, there he is, right in front of us. I just saw his ears. There he is. Still walking away? No, nope, he's walking back. Time to prone out. Actually, I don't think I'm going to prone out. I'm going to stay up one so I can see what he's doing a little better. I don't think he's startled anymore. I'm going to try to call him in. Help me. I'm lost. I'm scared. There's somebody trying to kill me. That's what that message was right there. If he just laid down right there. Let's see if we're going to play that game. I think if I get up to the top of this little hill right here, I'll be able to see down and out quite a ways. I don't know why my sound suddenly is a little patchy, but we'll deal with it. He was right here. Where did he go? Did he continue away? He probably did. That's what I would do if I were him. Be getting the hell out of Dodge. You can see where he pooped right there. You guys think I have really good perception when it comes to seeing like wolves in the long dark and like those ears, you should see my daughter play, man. Or my daughter do anything for that matter. She is the most amazing eagle eyes I've ever seen. She is so perceptive. All right, man, I'm gonna have the glasses because I have a feeling he's out here. He didn't walk that far that fast unless he started trotting again. I feel like he's going more this way. Move that tree out of the way. So he is trotting. Oh, he did it. He headed. Yeah, he headed out this way. Straight out. Oh, he's running. He must have somehow noticed me. Or maybe he just slowed down for a second and then took off running again. Sometimes he'll do that. Stop and start. Oh, I'm getting into these rocks. I don't want to be here. 
I want to be in this like sort of sort of fall down area here, whatever this is. A lot of freaking dead trees around here. Still running. No wonder he didn't respond back. Still in a panic state. Yeah, he didn't look like it there for a second. Like he slowed his roll a little bit, but just enough to throw me off. Almost looks like a nuclear winter, like black snow. It's starting to look bleak out here. Almost like a black and white movie. I guess nighttime's probably coming, right? What time is it? Yeah, 6.30. Yeah, we're getting there. He's still hauling balls though, this way. Those are run tracks right there. They're spaced out really far. Especially for an animal that small. Musk deer. I, I said uh, Sika. I don't... Yeah, I, I, I was saying Sika. It's actually musk. I saw the S and I was thinking Sika. They're both pretty small. I, th I think muscle. I think I'll work on musk on it. No. Yeah, it's not going to come eat. <laughs> that. Yeah, we don't have the, the collar for it, so we're not going to be able to call him in. We're just going to have to stock him up and shoot him. We're not going to be able to bring him back. Unless he wants to come back towards us already. I can't imagine this thing being this cagey. See some a lynx. We could call him in. I'm gonna do that actually. I'm gonna call him into here using that roe deer or that uh, predator caller. I'm gonna get up on that rock. Should be attractive to where the call came from. He could come from any angle. I'm going to take it nice and slow. Just kind of prone out up here probably. So I can see him come through the woods maybe. I don't think I'm going to be able to get up on that rock. I thought I could, but I don't think so. This log's probably going to be the best option for me. Can I get up on it? You going to let me on it? Not gonna let me on the log. That's all right. That's all right. I'll figure something out. Links would be kind of cool. I just have to. Not gonna have much time to take a shot. I can crawl up here. Can I do it? No. Should come. Well, he can he can flank like a coyote. I think this is about as good as I'm going to do. Kneeling down. I'm a little worried about my my sound being sort of patchy right now. Because I might not hear his footsteps until the very last second. All right. Heck, if it's a lynx, he's probably not gonna make much sound to begin with. Pretty stealthy. Wish that tree wasn't right there. Sort of blocking my, the primary approach. I'm gonna try calling out again.
Come on, buddy. It's dinner time. You know you're hungry. No point in even bringing out the binoculars at this range. Basically, I have to get it shot off pretty quick. Well, he's not calling out anymore, which either means he's stalking and trying to be sneaky in his approach, or he's not interested. He's left the area. Which is it going to be? I hear footsteps. Is that me? I think it's me. Yeah, I think that's me just turning, like I was telling you guys before. Well, nope. I see him. He's right behind this rock. He just went from there to there. Call that a successful hunt. He's going right to where that first caller was. All right, so I guess I know we know why he wasn't calling out again. Yeah, good stuff. All right, let's take a look here. Thanks, bird. I just got like cheer. Bird's like, yes, kill the cats. All right, double lung again. Silver. That was a number level six. No, oh, yeah. 24 meters. We had some close shots today, that's for sure. Well, two out of three ain't bad. So, all right. That's our, uh, that's our cat that we got. All right. Okay, guys. Well, oh, wow. Cash reward was pretty significant. About 50% more than a moose, actually. All right. The sound is acting a little weird, but uh, that's okay. We're going to end this episode here. Like, comment, subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Go ahead and reload first so the girls have a full uh, mag of ammo here. There we go. See you in the next one. Y'all take care.